clinical signs of duck virus hepatitis duck hepatitis virus type 1 the incubation period is very short open around 24 hours in experimental infection and morbidity is close to 100% concept of disease spread within a flock are very rapid and most mortality occur within one week of onset the affected duckling at first are slow and lag behind the flock within a short time they squat with their eyes partially closed fall on their side kick spasmodically and soon die they often die in the obstinate position this often occurs in one hour of the periods of the sites mortality is age related and occurs as follows tackling less than one week all up to 95% mortality, duckling 1 to 3 weeks old up to 50% mortality, duckling over 4 weeks and older duckling negligible mortality. Duck hepatitis virus type 2 and 3 affected duckling die within 1 to 2 hours after the onset of the clinical signs. Clinical signs usually appear within 1 to 4 days post infection. Signs include convulsion and stoneness. Mortality range from 10 to 50 percent. Nearly all girls with clinical signs die. Duck hepatitis virus type 3 is similar to duck hepatitis type 1, but mortality is rarely over 30 percent and morbidity is high. Lesion the liver is swollen and contains bunkitate or diffuse hemorrhage. The kidney may be swollen and the spleen enlarged. Diagnosis the sudden onset rapid spray, short of the course, focal hemorrhagic capabilities in it in young duckling. Suggest the diagnosis of duck hepatitis virus. Duck hepatitis virus type 1 can usually be isolated in pregnant chicken egg or duck embryos or one day old susceptible duckling. Once the virus is isolated, it can be identified by serum neutralization using non hepatitis and serum. Identification is also possible by neglation of the virus into both the susceptible and the immune duckling. Duck hepatitis virus type 2 can be identified through electromicroscopy on liver or blood. Duck hepatitis virus type 3 can't be isolated in chicken embryos and it is difficult to reproduce in duckling. The choreoalantoic membrane of duck embryo are the preferred route of regulation. Direct fluorescent test of duckling liver has been reported. Control duck hepatitis virus type 1 in the initial stage of outbreak all susceptible duckling should be inoculated in the with duck hepatitis virus and serum. On inoculation should be adequate if the anti-serum is potent, a potent and serum can be made from the blood of the natural or experimental victim ducks. Use anti-serum when the symptoms appear immediately. Many ducks breeders prefer to vaccinate their breeding stock at 3 to 4 month interval to maintain a high antibody type. Strict biosecurity procedures must be employed information concerning vaccine vaccine.